Hello, Mountain Chic family. For those of you that are new to my channel, welcome. Today, Tatum Rose and I, and yes, we have been told we look alike, yes. <laughs> we are gonna be working on a square rectangle wreath. And we're gonna work with Dollar Tree Potpourri and a Dollar Tree 8x10 frame. All right, so you don't wanna miss this. It's gonna be really cute. So stick around, stick around and let's get to craft. All right, for this project, all you're gonna need is a picture frame, building blocks, some ribbon, sandpaper, and some glue. Also, if you check the comments below, I do have a tutorial on how to make the cotton stems using all of Dollar Tree stuff and some sticks from your yard. So it helps to save a lot of money. Also, if you notice at the end of the video, I changed my mind and decided I am gonna continue with this project a little bit further. And so it ended up not being a wreath. I think that if I um, do a wreath, which I'm planning on it, I'm gonna use a bigger frame to match what you see at the end. So definitely stay tuned because it is so cute. The reason why I'm adding the building blocks is just to make this a little bit larger and you'll see it kind of gives a little rustic so it's kind of mountain chic meets vintage and you will see at the end. I ended up using three of the building blocks on that one corner just for some more stability for when I glue the cotton stems. You can certainly brush paint this if you would like. I just wanted to get outside and give it a good spray paint with a dark color that will cover it all to where the building blocks and the frame are all the same color. And um, also, as you know, spray paint does dry a little faster. So that was my whole idea on that. I already had the paints because I wanted it to match with other decor that I have made, but you can choose whatever colors you like. I just blotted a couple colors on there, like a cream color and a beige. And then once it dried, I took a sandpaper to it, just to give it that really cute mountain chic look. Again, I do make my own cotton stems out of Dollar Tree items. So if you're interested in doing that yourself, just check out the video and I'll put it down in the comments below. These sticks literally came from my yard. Okay, so we could stop here and it would make a really cute door wreath, but this is where I just couldn't stop. I had to keep going.
This is where Mountain Chic meets vintage. This really is vintage sheet music. And I thought it would be so pretty in the background. If I would have known that this is what I was going to end up doing, but sometimes those creative juices just get to flowing, I would have actually put the sheet music and the piece of glass back in before I started decorating. This would look so beautiful on an old piano. I just love this. I hope you have felt inspired today. I have certainly enjoyed it and I will see you next time.